Welcome everyone. My name is uh, Amir Dalili. I'm here to talk to you about Turinga. <coughs> Turinga is a peer-to-peer -peer platform that creates a marketplace for travel experiences. It empowers anyone in the world to become a tour host and share what they know about their part of the world with everyone else. So if you imagine with me, you sign up to Turinga, you create a profile, and then you go on to post a tour. A tour has a name, a description of what you're going to do, uh, what you're going to see, uh, a bio for your host, what, what are they all about, and a uh, time, of course, and a date, uh, and other details. So you, you post this tour, the travelers see it, they like it, they sign up to it, and then you actually meet offline, you go on this tour, and you enjoy this experience. You come back to Turinga, you rate your experience, you review the tour host, and you're building a community where everyone knows what's going on with everyone else. Now, I'll give you some examples to get a feel for this. So, imagine an architectural professor who goes and takes a walk in downtown Alexandria, shows you all the buildings and talks to you about it. Or a political activist who walks with you in Tahrir, telling you their account of what happened when they were there during the revolution. Imagine a food blogger who will take you to all the small food stalls in their area that you would have never found out about without them. Now, who are our travelers? Our travelers are people who like to immerse themselves deeply in the culture that they're traveling in, who want an authentic experience, and who are uh, into sustainable travel, and who are very good at using the internet. These people, we figured, are young with high disposable income, but short travel time, or some of them have longer travel times, but a, a lower budget. They're also the baby boomers who want to re-experience the world in a different view. But this is a double-sided market. We're not only looking at travelers, we're also looking at our tour hosts. Our tour hosts are people who have a passion, who have something they want to share with the world. They're fascinating, they're interesting, and they have very good social reach, whether offline or online, so they would attract people to their tours and to Turinga. Now, why would they be doing this? Because they want to build their street credit, because they want to give back to the community, maybe they want to earn some cash, or if you really have a passion, you will know how much you want to share it with the rest of the world. We do have competitors in our market, a couple of direct ones and a number of indirect ones, but our edge is that we do all this as a community. We build personal relationships between the people who go on these tours. You're not just going into a site and buying off an e-commerce template some tours and going out. This is real people meeting each other. Now, we built a uh, private beta uh, demo and we invited 300 users in. We ran tens of tours, I ran some of them myself, and we took all the feedback and all the information we got from this, distilled it, and we're now building the second version, which you can see a screenshot of here. These are the tour cards you see when you log in. These tour cards are basically a small summary of the tour. You see your tour host, the price, a small description, what's going on. You click on either to see more details, and there are a lot more features on the website uh, that you can use. Now, our revenue model, how are we going to make money? The hosts, they host these tours for free. The travelers go on and they pay some cash for it. We process this payment, we take a 15% commission, and we funnel the rest of the money through. Um, this model means that it's risk-free for the hosts because they don't have to pay anything to host it. It's risk-free for the people who go on the tours because we only process the payments after the tour has gone through and we've ensured that it uh, went on quite well. And it means we're making money from day one. Now, we have been self-financed so far. We are looking for $50,000 seed uh, financing so that we can cover our development costs, our marketing costs, take us from beta to live, and actually start. Turinga is aiming to be the largest tour operator in the world. So, uh, we want to see you in our booth, and if you don't have the cash on you, we'll take credit or check.